Turmoil continues at Port Ritchie City Hall. Weeks after the city's former mayor arrested, its interim mayor finds himself behind bars as well. News Channel 8's Victoria Price reports tonight from Port Ritchie. Hey, good evening. Just last night, Vice Mayor Terry Rowe was here presiding over a city council meeting. Tonight, he's behind bars accused of interfering with the state's investigation into the man he's filling in for. Go to council business. At Tuesday's city council meeting, Port Ritchie Vice Mayor Terry Rowe implored his colleagues to temporarily fill his seat while he serves as interim mayor. This position is to be filled, in its own words, immediately. Little did the public know that Rowe would soon find himself in trouble with the law, thanks to embattled former mayor Dale Massad. And there's a lot of moving pieces and parts to this case. On Wednesday, FDLE agents arrested Rowe on charges of obstruction, conspiracy to commit obstruction, and use of a two-way communication device to facilitate a crime. Investigators would not elaborate on how they believe Rowe interfered with the Dale Massad investigation. Massad is accused of attempted murder and practicing medicine without a license. He was arrested, suspended, and then resigned as mayor last month. Roe has previously said he considers Massad a friend. Bottom line for this uh, charge and this case this afternoon is if you are not a witness or a subject of any ongoing active criminal investigation, uh, I ask you that you please don't inject or insert yourself into one. We reached out to the rest of Port Ritchie City Council for comment on the arrest. We only heard back from Richard Bloom, who says he's shocked and confused by the news. Reporting in Port Ritchie, Victoria Price, News Channel 8.